Hi fellow hobby khakis, how have you guys been doing? Yup, it's the end of the year! And it's been an exciting uh, first week of uh, December whereby we had a lot of uh, new upcoming releases whether is it from uh, Kampla side or whether is it from uh, the Ichiban Kuji side. Okay, so for this week, um, we are presenting to you our unboxing and review of an already released, well anticipated Ichiban Kuji set. Okay, basically it is the Ichiban Kuji Dragon Ball versus Omnibus. It's already in the market and uh, of course uh, we need to thank our friends from uh, Asobi for providing us the sample to have a good look at all the fabulous prices within this set and of course not to mention you know the various figures OMG okay they do have a lot of figures within this set and it took us quite a while before we actually can uh, you know do a good shoot for all of them of course not to mention the uh, last price as you can see from the opening it would be the grade 8 Vegeta okay so whew, it's excellent okay so for those of you who are aiming for this set same thing do leave some for us to do our draw if not take more so that we can actually go for the last prize okay so so uh, as mentioned the previous set was the golden ape okay so finally they're re releasing the uh, Vegeta great ape so how many of you is uh, looking forward to Zambu okay the entire last prize okay so all the best to you guys who's aiming for that and uh, for us definitely we are aiming for the uh, Jiren Okay, within this set itself, it's so beautiful and huge. Okay, and uh, so for a better view, please join us and look at the unbox and preview of this set. Let's go. Alright, first up, we have our iPrice. Basically, these are 8 sets of clear files that comes with 16 different designs. Basically, this set features images from the Dragon Ball Super Universe and manga. So here are the first 8 designs. In general, they are very colourful A4 size folder that features our heroes versus their nemesis. Following are the next 8 designs. The odds for drawing the eye prize is basically 30 out of 80 tickets. Following that will be our H prize, namely these are our towers and handkerchief. For the handkerchief design, we have the Sangoku, Sangoku in Saiyan 3 form, Majin Buu, and Great Ape Vegeta. And for the towers, we have Sangoku and Jiren. And the odds for the H prize would be 24 out of 80 tickets. Alright, moving on to our G Prize. Basically, these are Japanese cups with black and white images of the various characters. With regards to the odds for our G Prize, basically it's 18 out of 
80 tickets. Yup, finally moving on to the figures within the set. And for our F prize, we have Majin Buu. A special mention would be that this is the first time we have Majin Buu within a Ichiban Kuji set. This is definitely one of the rare ones with very detailed sculpt in general for the entire figure and not to mention the colors have been applied very beautifully. I believe it's going to be one very popular figure for everyone. However, the odds for getting this figure is... Drum roll! 1 out of 80 tickets. Oh well, moving on to our E prize, we have Sun Goku in Saiyan 3 form. Although this is not the very first Sun Goku in Saiyan 3 form in the market, but nonetheless, we really like the entire scalp, especially how the hair has been done. However, the art is also 1 out of 80 tickets. Next up, for our D prize, it's none other than our giant figure. Super Saiyan Broly Was really wondering why do they actually have so many versions of Broly Is it a little bit too much? Especially for its size Many of us would have a lack of space To have all the variants And the best thing is that For this set The odds for drawing a Broly is 2 out of 80 Moving on to our C prize We have Super Saiyan Gogeta It is no less a very popular figure within the uh, Dragon Ball series However, this time round, special painting has been used on this figure You can see clearly that there is a glittery shine on various blue colored area Maybe this is to simulate its Super Saiyan form Of course, definitely with that, it will be tough to be able to draw this figure so the odds would be 1 out of 80 tickets. Next up to the highlights and one of the figures that we are looking forward to would be our B prize. And here we have Jiren in its final form. In terms of size, it is comparable to Broly. And of course, not to mention how well sculpted it is. Every detail on the muscle group. And not forgetting the facial expression. Wow, look at that. This is definitely one of the figures that we hope to get if we do draw on this set. However, we believe that we'll have a lot of contender for this. Right guys? And best of all, the odds for this figure is 1 out of 80. And last but not least to our A prize. And we have Sun Goku Mastered Ultra Instinct. In terms of scalp, we are really amazed with how this figure stands out among the rest, especially on the paint job as well as the sculpting of the muscle of the entire body. Wow, look at that silver hair, as well as the facial expression.
So here's a good news for those who are aiming for this figure. You have a chance of 2 out of 80 tickets. Before we move on to the final figure for the day, let's have a look at how all the previous figure comes together. Looks awesome and great, right? That is provided we have the luck to gather all of them as well as the necessary space. Here comes the grand entrance of our last prize, the Great Ape Vegeta. Following the success of the last Golden Ape, the Great Ape Vegeta bears the same quality as before. Not only standing at a height of more than 30 cm, the details on the figure is exceptionally good. And we believe that, just like the Golden Ape, this is going to be as hot as hot cake, especially in the aftermarket. We really can't bear to leave this figure back to its rightful owner at Asobi. But we don't have a choice. So, for those of you who would like to have a good view of this great ape Vegeta, you can find the entire set on display right at Asobi. This marks the end of our unbox and review of the Ichiban Kuji Dragon Ball vs Omnibus. And once again, thanks to our friend at Asobi for providing us this sample and having some great time with the Great Ape Vegeta. Of course, not forgetting the rest of the figures. And of course, do follow us on our Facebook and Instagram for the latest news of recent release as well as what we will be doing. And also, do give us a like, subscribe, and click on the notification bell for future content. We hope you enjoy our video and we hope to see you around. Do stay safe in the current environment and peace.